Well, welcome to the newest edition of Unique in the Boutique. Today we're going to be talking some good smells, fragrances, and things that remind you about cooking. Want to know what I'm talking about? Stay tuned. Hi, and thank you for joining me today with Unique in the Boutique. My name is Gretchen, and I wanted to share with you today a little bit about our Milk House Candles. Around the holiday season, it becomes a very popular thing to create the warmth feeling of food. We all think food. It starts as soon as the weather turns. Now, let me take that back because we're in New Mexico. It starts as soon as it turns September. That's why it's September, because September gives you a whole month to build till October and again to November and again to December. So with that being said, I'm here to tell you about some of our amazing candles that we have lined up for you. If you're into making your house smell like cooking, I mean, anybody who goes into a house and smells something good, I tell you what, they're gonna love coming to visit, but more so, it also helps you in developing memories. So anytime you have family, friends, any type of special event, light your favorite candle, because believe it or not, when you smell that candle years down the road, it's gonna bring back those memories. So, if I've got your attention yet, let's see. Do you have to cook to have your house smell like cookies? Nope. We've got Nana's cookies. She'll take care of that job for you. We also have some other wonderful fragrances that started from the fall with pumpkin spices, chives, all the way up to these nice, wonderful, harmonious things like silver birch that smell just like the forest and different types of spices all melded into one thing. So if you're not looking for a food fragrance, but you're looking for something that might be more holiday themed, we have those as well. I'm gonna run through some of these lines on here on names just to give you an idea of what might grab your attention. And think gifts along these lines because you know, we want our house to smell good, but don't you want your house to smell good and your friends to house to smell good? I mean, it would make me want to go visit. <laughs> so with that said, we have Rake Pile Leap. Again, the only way you're gonna know some of these fragrances and what they smell like is to come smell it. And guess what? We have our jars of coffee beans set aside for you so you can neutralize your nose and your palate and get to smell on these candles because they all offer different fragrances. We also have, I'm gonna run down the line. Let's see. Looking, 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 looking. Coffee break. I know coffee is something that goes year round. I'm gonna say that one now because I can't do my day without a coffee. We have welcome home. That's a great one. It's also good for people who might just be getting a house, might be getting ready to get in a house, someone who came to visit you for the holidays, or if you just want your house to smell like warm baked goods going on in your house, this is a good one. Uh, we also have cabin fever. That one is very popular. We've had cabin fever for years. And with that, people come in and again, again, and again. So we have these available in melts as well. We have a whole arrangement of melts. But with that, we also have warm wool. We have sweet woods. We have fresh cut Fraser, which everyone loves a nice pine smell. But this one does not smell like a cleaner. I know in the past, some of the, the pine smells can actually get a little soapy smelling where they smell more like uh, I don't want to say the natural cleaner, but there's a cleaner you can get that has the word clean in it. <laughs> and it smells very piney. Um, and there are some smells that can take your Fraser idea to another level. This one is a real true tree fragrance. It really smells like a Fraser. Silver Birch is another one. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Let's see, Welcome Home, Holiday Home, which is another one that has a lot of spices. Um, Let's see, plumberry and basil, that's a cooking fragrance. Um, milk and sugar is year round. If you burn milk and sugar with your coffee candle, oh my goodness, it smells like a fresh cup of hot coffee. It's amazing. There's also some layer cake. Again, it's food. And moving on, we have a whole nother rack on this right side. We've got malt cider, pumpkin pancakes, apple strudel, Nana's Cookies, Pure Vanilla, Crane Apple Punch, Caramel Apple, Silver Birch, uh, Holly and Ivy, Victorian Christmas. If you love a strong cinnamon candle, you're going to love Victorian Christmas. It smells so, so, so good. You have to come smell that one. Uh, Winter Walk. Um, 
trying not to repeat myself, but I might. And caramel corn and flannel and frost. Now we've also got these little mini jars in that that's brand new to the system because we had some and they were all these little guys here, but they had so many people buying these because they didn't want to commit to a full size candle yet. And also for gifts, guys, you want something that's small? This is a great way to like touch and feel and see if it's a candle fragrance for you. So they went from this and they started with all of the other little candles. So all these little candles look the same now. They have the lids, the handles, um, and they're all done up. So if you're a crafter also, these are wonderful for using again and again. You've always got something you can put in a container, right? Well, I'm gonna tell you something about the wax. Everybody's got candles, but not everybody has a good candle. What's the difference between these candles, for instance, and a candle that's not a good candle? It's the wax. It's the part that you're actually burning or melting to infuse that fragrance into the air. And these are going to be completely wonderful clean burning candles. They are going to be called, and this is the difference between the two, okay? This one is 100% paraffin free soy and beeswax. Now the big thing with it being paraffin free, I'm a huge candle person. When I go to Walmart even, I can't not go by the fragrances and just smell it. I just, I love fragrance. And my biggest thing about the candle wax is knowing one, that I'm getting what I paid for. I don't wanna have a candle that smells one way and burns a different um, fragrance. And that does happen with some candles and it happens because of heat. So having that little taste of candle wax um, in your house or coming in here and smelling it and stuff like that, you get a real genuine idea of what the fragrance is gonna be like. It doesn't change on you. And that's because it doesn't burn hot. If you have a candle that does have paraffin in it, let me tell you about this. If it's paraffin free soy, it means it's non-toxic. Um, and the old fashioned paraffin wax is made from petroleum oil and produces harmful byproducts when burned or melted. So if you get a soy candle that is paraffin free, it's gonna be safer right off the bat. You don't have these chemicals um, spilling over, burning hotter um, and infusing into the air where you breathe all this because you know anything that's a chemical is something that you can ingest. It matters. Another thing is, is soy, wa soy wax does not release soot while paraffin wax candles release petrocarbon soot. And what that means is, is whenever you're burning the candle, do you notice how sometimes the inside of a jar, for instance, turns black or your holder turns black? That means you're burning a petroleum candle, okay? That paraffin wax is petroleum filled. And what that oil does is it attaches itself to the inside of your jar candle. As it burns down, the wax burns, but that paraffin oil stays and it continues to burn and send off those chemicals into the air. And another thing it can do is it can create really hot temperatures for your wax. So it becomes a burning issue if you have pets, children, even ourselves, whenever we're blowing out a candle. So you wanna consider these things when you find wax. Having a beeswax is wonderful too because it's a natural wax substance. Again, it's not another chemical being added to the combination. Okay, so again, these are 100% paraffin free soy wax, beeswax, candles and they are made in the good old USA in Iowa. So if you're looking for a good wax to burn in your house this year and you're wanting something that's safer, you're looking for gift ideas, or you're just looking for some good fragrance in your home for some soft beautiful glow and the ambiance it puts off with our decor, by all means please come see us. We would love to walk around the floor with you and show you the different wax melts that we have and as far as our different candle sizes and stuff too I can tell you we have candles on here that go from 35 plus hours to 150 plus hours of burn time. So you talk about getting your bang for your buck you get it. Milk House Candles is a wonderful company we would love to share you share with you all of the information that you might have questions on but more so just have that experience available to you because this wax is the bomb. So with that said, I hope that you come and visit us at Livewell on the corner of First in Florida. We are located directly across the street from the Civic Center. Please come and see us. We'd love to talk with you and shop candle wax. Until then, have a good one.